This is question 12 from the 2008 calculator paper. We're told a shop sells mobile phones. The table shows the data. Work out the percentage increase in the number of mobile phones sold from April to May. So we can see that in April we sold 85, in May we sold 91. So we can see that we've increased by six mobile phones. What we need to do is we need to work that out, what that is as a percentage increase from April to May. The way that we do that is we simply take the amount that has increased divide it by the amount that was sold in April, 85, and multiply it by 100. That will tell us what our percentage increase is. So, let's do that. 6 divided by 85, then multiply that by 100, and that gives us an answer of 7.058823529. Now we're asked to give it to three significant figures, so to three significant figures it's going to be 7.058 8 is above 5 so it's going to be 7.0 we round 5 up to the next number so 7.06 so our answer here is going to be 7.06 part b work out the three month moving averages for the information in the table the first one has been worked out for you so <coughs> let's look at our table and a moving average is simply calculating the amount for that month there um, would be the first three months then we would then work out the next three months average so work out from February, March, April so we've worked so we've already been told that 69 that's January, February, March we now need to work out what February, March, April is so let's do that so 64 plus 73 plus 85 divided by 3 that gives us 74 so 74 is the average for February, March and April then we just need to work out what the average would then be for the final three months and so we again just do exactly the same thing 73 plus 85 plus 91 that gives us 249 divided by 3 that's going to give us a value of 83 so our answer there would be 74 and 83 and simply quite it's quite a descriptive way really of, of summing this up we are simply calculating the mean as we move along in 3 month periods so we can see here that we've worked out the mean for those three months then the move mean for the next three months along and so what we say is it's just a moving average it just keeps moving along next three months and next three months and so our moving averages were 69, 74 and 83 we can see here the reason this is done it's generally done for business purposes and it's done so that you can get an idea of the trend of sales so we can see that the trend is an upward trend here we're selling more as time goes by.